Plaintiff Carla Baharwi says she and the defendant played bingo together, and Carla would often give her rides to bingo. Carla claims the defendant confessed that she smoked marijuana, and she sometimes seemed high when Carla picked her up. Carla's suing her for the balance due on two loans. Defendant Wendy Doucette says Carla turned all of her bingo friends against her, and she had them come to Wendy's house to intimidate and threaten her. Wendy insists Carla is suing for more than she owes. Start with you. Yes. Hi, my name is Carla Baharwi. I met Wendy Doucette a few years ago as, at a bingo week that we met at, and we became bingo, we became bingo friends. And I don't know how it came about, but then I started picking her up and bringing her to and from bingo a couple nights a week that we went down, by, down in Lynn, Massachusetts, where we live. Um, and then she mentioned to me a while later that she smoked marijuana. Um, I, did, I never took, never did it. Why does she look so healthy? <laughs> Thank you. Um, sometimes when I would pick her up, she seemed stoned. She seemed really quiet, really out of it. She would sit in the back or the front of my car if I had another friend with me. And I would say to her, oh, you're so quiet. You, you're not going to sit, you know, not talk or anything. Well, you better and take notes on what this weed do so it's... <laughs> <laughs> so it stop people from talking too much. So the people that talk too much when they come around you and annoy you, well, just hand them a joint. Yeah, shut them off. Take the joint, man. Take your hit. Um, I, ne I never did it. It didn't, it didn't bother me. Maybe about a year later or she so. She didn't eat all your treats? <laughs> <laughs> all the cupcakes and bingo. The munchies, go ahead. <laughs> and then, like, maybe about a year later, we went out to another bingo on a Monday night, and she wanted to tell me something. I didn't know what she wanted to say because when I did first meet Wendy, she just seemed a little different to me. Like I did, I, you know, I never knew what. And then we were at the bingo and she says, well, I don't know how to she tell you. She's gazing at me, ma'am. That ain't no weed, that look you giving me. You getting high off anything <laughs> no. else? More than weed, that ain't no weed. <laughs> I know weed when I see it and that ain't, that ain't no weed. I don't know what that is. You sure? Positive. Nothing else? Nothing else. <laughs> No. Oh, no. Okay. And then she mentioned to me a while later that she smoked marijuana. Um, I did. I never took. Never did it. Why does she look so healthy? <laughs> Thank you. Um, Plaintiff Carla Baharwi is suing her former friend, who claims Carla sent their bingo friends to her house to threaten her. All right, go ahead. And then, like I said, about maybe another year after I met her or so. She wanted to tell me something, and I didn't, like I said, I didn't know a word. She told me that she liked women, and um, and it didn't go Ooh, any you further. You got some women getting hot in here over there. <laughs> <laughs> you got a few lesbians in the crowd, and that's good. We welcome everybody. But you heard when you said that, it was, ooh, shoot. Ooh, ah, you're getting some action today. No, I don't think so. Go ahead. <laughs> Go ahead. Well, when she, she, when she said that to me, it, um, it didn't bother me. It didn't affect our, you, you know, our, I was, I thought I was still friends with her. We went about business. Nothing, yeah. nothing went any further than that. All right. Let me hear from you, ma'am. Yes. Um, how are you doing, Your Honor? Fine. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> um, Hope you actually, didn't mind me having fun. Actually, with you. she mm -hmm. turned my bingo friends against me. How so? She had them come to my house. They came to my house. They threatened me. They about intimidated what? me about saying that I owed her money. Okay. So before the money, though, how was your relationship with her? Fine. Did you win when you went to bingo much? Well, not much. No, it's no. very hard to win. Well, you don't play. It's very you hard to win. <laughs> when you're high, yeah, probably. No, you got to get the right cards and the right numbers. It's I hard don't to go into bingo on stuff high. When you had off that weed. And I don't get high when I go to bingo. You concentrate. Go ahead. I didn't try to hit on her or nothing. I just explained to her about my personal life because I figured we were friends. Okay, it so what you bringing that up for? What difference does that, that make? Yeah. Did that, why case. did you have to tell me that if it didn't make a difference <laughs> in the case? Let me just say, when people distinguish folks' sexuality and it's not a subject, it's almost a kind of moving toward discrimination. Because yeah. why do you have to bring that up? Mm -hmm if you're looking th at them as the same as everybody else. Right. Why do you have to distinguish it then? 
I don't sit up here and say, well, yeah, such and such, my gay friend. I just say my friend. Right. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So let's not do that. And uh, Well, I never, when she mentioned it, I never told anybody. Yeah, but you're telling me. Well, I need yeah, to know. I, know. I, I thought well, we needed to know well, because no, you were any, saying she hit on you. We well, need to know no, that. Well, no, she never did that, no. What you like? No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Go ahead. Since we talk about what everybody like, and it's irrelevant to the case. That's fine. <laughs> Let me stop while I'm behind. <laughs> all right, so you all all right other than that. Tell me but, about the loans. Well, I made two. I made two loans to her. I made her one loan in February of this year, and then I made another loan to her in April of this year. They were both cash loans to her. How much? Um, one was five seventy six, and the other one was a hundred. She gave me a hundred and forty four dollars cash and the remaining balance is yeah. the five when was she five. to repay like when she would get her income if we agreed to um on the first <laughs> income day, what ma'am her, her, her social security income yeah on the first oh, of every okay. month she I was, thought you were gonna she say agreed to pay me tax. so much money <laughs> <laughs> That's right. and if and if she um won any money at bingo okay she would that's Give why you some... claiming you never win. <laughs> I ain't never she seen somebody admit me. to never win. I never win, you know, no, I never really won anything. Me. Let's see, uh, <laughs> what do you say to the loans, ma'am? She at one point told me I owed her $604, and I told her to take me to court. That's when she decided to take me to court. Make, now, makes sense. Now, I didn't know her that much, and I did pay the 144 but I also paid 136 And so... The only dispute here is a hundred and thirty-six dollar payment, correct? Correct. She's because I made, don't. She's I, I don't she remember. Made and you don't I don't remember it. that payment. All right. I have in front of me is what I gave, what uh, with a signed document with Let's her see that document. with her signature on it. Thank you. You're welcome. All right, and this is the document declaring how much will be owed, yeah. uh, and there's nothing reflecting payment as of, of course not. Uh, April. But you paid her when and how? Tell me about that one hundred and thirty-six dollar payment. It was all cash. Where were you all? At bingo when I would win. If I won a hundred, you say you never win. Right. <laughs> That's well, when I won a hundred, I would give her forty. If you I won would fifty, give her, uh -huh. if I won fifty, I'd give her twenty. And there was a couple of times I won 25, I gave her five. And then when I... Yeah. <laughs> How about the 144? Where did that come from? Same thing. It was all... The all same in... night? No, it was different nights. Okay, so the 144 came in how many payments? How many uh, bingo To be wins? honest, I can't remember. You don't I remember? I would always Somebody take is mistaken. I... We would all... Oh, mm -hmm. Sorry. Plaintiff Carla Baharwi is suing her former friend who claims Carla sent their bingo friends to her house to threaten her. I don't think anybody's being dishonest because if you were gonna lie, you'd lie about the whole thing. Yeah. Or you'd lie about <laughs> more than 136. If you owed five something, you'd say, well, I gave her 500, I owe her 36. No. Now, that's a good lie. You want to change it to that? No. You don't want to change it to no. that? All right. So that's why I believe her, ma'am. She doesn't know how to lie because she doesn't lie frequently, do you? <laughs> Thank you, Your Honor. Yeah, but you did admit to your memory. You said, yeah. I don't remember. I don't remember, because it's been a while. Yeah, well, you remember? Well, uh -oh. I didn't write down. I didn't, I didn't, oh, no. I didn't write down all the I'm going to get this woman. She, I'm going to give her what she admit. How much you say you owe? How much you say you owe? About 400. All right, because can't nobody remember anything. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> but I know I can't remember. Well, I know these I don't remember money. There. That's about the yes, only that's thing. that's right. <laughs> <laughs> How do I know whether to give you 532? Because you just said you don't quite remember either. But she, Wendy Doucette does know because when we would go to bingo. Wendy just said she don't remember a thing. So no, because she, she knows me what that I, I would them. give her money and... Sometimes yeah, but she then you say, well, you're offering, but well, I like your company. She's playing crazy today. <laughs> yeah. So I don't know what to tell you. Do you have any communication reflecting an amount after May? Only what I have, May? In, what's in front of you no. and what I have in front Nothing of you. Nothing after May? No. No. I, she hasn't given me no. So you do remember. Yes, I do remember that. I told her. Tell me for the plaintiff. Uh, she got her memory back. Have a good day, Tessa. Thank you, sir. <laughs>